What's up everyone, I'm Steven and welcome to my channel. This video is all about Charles Schwab options trading. I'm going to show you what options are, show you how to apply for options trading on Charles Schwab, and show you how to trade options on Charles Schwab. There are many types of options and option strategies. Options are a great way to hedge, generate income, and speculate in the market. Charles Schwab is known to provide a premium options trading experience and industry-leading low cost with no base commission and just 65 cents for base contract. I also happen to be a longtime user of Charles Schwab, so not only do I know the platform inside and out, I will take you on a tour of my account and show you what options trading at Charles Schwab looks like. Let's start with talking about what options are. Options are financial instruments that are derivatives based on the value of underlying securities such as stocks. An options contract offers the buyer the opportunity to buy or sell depending on the type of contract they hold, the underlying asset. Calls give the buyer the right but not the obligation to buy the underlying asset at the strike price specified in the option contract. Investors buy calls when they believe the price of the underlying asset will increase and sell calls if they believe it will decrease. Puts give the buyer the right but not the obligation to sell the underlying asset at the strike price specified in the contract. The writer or seller of the put option is obligated to buy the asset if the put buyer exercises their option. Investors buy puts when they believe the price of the underlying asset will decrease and sell puts if they believe it will increase. Now let's show you how to apply for options trading. You can apply for options trading on Charles Schwab in one of two ways. The first is to fill out the manual form below and mail it to Charles Schwab. And the second is to apply for Charles Schwab options trading online, which I'll show you now. Go to the service tab at the top of the toolbar, then hit account settings. From this screen, you can apply for options trading. There are four different approval levels you can apply for, which allows different option strategies you can use once approved. The levels are determined by how sophisticated the option strategy is and the higher levels of risk associated with them. When applying for the first time, you're most likely going to be approved for level 0 or level 1. You may be approved for level 2 and level 3 depending on your assets and level experience. Level 0 includes covered calls, covered puts, buy rights, unwinds, covered rollouts, cash secure puts, and the objectives are capital preservation, income, and investment hedge. Level 1 includes all of level 0 plus long calls, puts, straddles, combinations, and strategies. Objectives are growth, speculation, and income. Level 2 and level 3 require margin on the account, which is a higher level of risk. When trading on margin, you're borrowing from Swab using your Swab brokerage assets as security for your loan. Level 2 includes condors, butterflies, and all sorts of spreads. The objective is for speculation and income. Level 3 includes uncovered calls, puts, rollouts, ratio spreads, and short straddles, combinations and strangles, and objective is speculation and income. Go ahead and apply for the level that will align with what you want to do with options. If you are brand new to options, avoid margins as the risk is higher, and you can always apply for a higher level in the future. We'll apply for level 1 as an example. There will be questions about your options experience, net assets, and after you complete the online application for options trading, it could be anywhere from one business day to a week to get approved. After you are approved, you'll be able to trade options. To trade options, go to the trade at the top of the toolbar. Then under options, hit trading. We'll demonstrate a long call option on Tesla stock by entering in a long call into Tesla. We'll have the right to buy Tesla once it reached the strike price of our option contract. We're making a speculative gamble that Tesla will go up. At the action, buy the open means we are buying to open an option contract. Then we enter the quantity of contracts. Each contract is equal to 100 shares of the underlying stock. So if you buy one contract, that refers to 100 shares of the underlying stock. Then we enter the order type. Market order will execute at the market price. Limit order will execute at the price you set as the limit. The final step is to enter the symbol, and the strike price is in the center, and the expiration date is on the left. If the strike price does not reach the strike price by the expiration date, the option will expire worthless. For a call, option will be more expensive with a lower strike price, and the further out the expiration date is. 
Let's go ahead and select Tesla with an expiration date of January 22nd of 2021 and a strike price of $830 for demonstration. Once we select the option, we see the estimated cost for this option contract at $2,600, which is for 100 underlying shares. Click here for the profit loss chart. The profit loss chart will show you when you expect to break even and make money. You will see that you break even at $840 on January 19th and break even around $855 at expiration and make money after that point. Then you review the order and place the order. Hope you guys enjoyed this content. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit that notification bell for more videos delivered to you. If you guys have any other questions or comments, go ahead and leave those below. And you guys have a great one.